welcome back to my channel. If you've never been here before, my name is Lizbeth and I share my personal style, my love for easy beauty and some fun reviews in between. And today I wanna to talk about 2021 summer trends that I'm loving, that I'm gonna be rocking, that I'm gonna be bringing out again. So if you want to freshen up your summer wardrobe, get some extra inspiration, try some new things, then keep watching. So first on my list of trends I'm excited to try this summer are knits which is kind of opposing because you think you'd want to wear breathable things, really flowy things, airy things in the summer, but I'm feeling knits. I've seen tons of cool knit pieces and I actually have some amazing ones that I want to share with you babes. So first up is this crochet top. My cousin actually made it for me for my birthday. It's absolutely stunning. She's beyond talented and I actually envisioned this with a bathing suit, a little bikini in the summer. Such a cute little cover up, but it will definitely look amazing with some vintage Levi's and she's just so so freaking talented. I'll link her Instagram below if you guys want to purchase something. But I also saw a really cute Bottega Veneta crocheted clutch, which would be a great DIY, but that definitely inspired me to embrace more knits as well. But I just love, love, love this. Another great option if that is a little too bold for you. I mean, this is bold too. It is green. I love green. But this is a lot more versatile. I feel like you could wear this to work if you guys are going back into the office. This is something that is a bit more conservative and still brings out that knit vibe that I'm loving for summer. I love the collar, I love the thick rib, and I love that it's buttoned down. I've actually styled this for a night out. I rocked it in Miami with some faux leather pants that were from Miss Lola as well, and such a fun pop bright outfit, and I loved it. And I actually kind of buttoned it probably to here and left the rest open just because I am petite. I have a short torso, so definitely love the peekaboo vibe of that. And I just love this color. That's a little too bold for you. I have this amazing Paloma wool halter that is cream with some orange in it. Love, love, love this. It's actually a matching set. There are two trends in this top that I'm excited to share with you, babes. Knit, also a matching set. It has these really great pants. So maybe a top isn't your vibe and you want to experiment with some bottoms. I love these pants, they're like a flared pant. There's also skirts, you can also do a dress, you guys. I have this amazing dress. I'm pretty sure I got it from Verge Girl. Um, it's this halter and look at how beautiful the coloring is. It's really great. I will say this one was hot. I wore it in Palm Springs, but if you go with like a halter or a wrap top, like this green one from Simonette, which I'm sure you babes have seen, doesn't look like much of a top, but actually twists and ties into different styles. And I shared a tutorial on Instagram if you want to peep that, but it is a really fun and great color, which I'll be talking about color as well. But I love the halter style and that leads me to the next trend, halters. Definitely reminds me of the 90s, but I just love how fresh and flirty they are. And yeah, definitely feminine. So this is one of my favorites and maybe like a top is too bold. Definitely go with a dress. There are so many different dress styles. You can do something that's knit. I've also seen really great more formal dresses. So maybe something you wanna experiment for a wedding. I found this really cute dress off of ASOS or misguided. I think it was ASOS and it's zebra and I actually ordered it because I loved it. I just thought it was so great and little elements of that in dresses. I think it's a fun thing to experiment, try something new. Um, another great top that I have that I absolutely love is this one from Beginning Boutique and actually twists, a little twist stitch. This is also knit as well. So as you can see, you don't need to buy so much um, to get the trend. You can get it with one top. This is knit, also a halter and it'll definitely freshen up your wardrobe, but it is such a cute piece, such a great color. So I'm digging knits, I'm digging halters. All right, now let's talk about color, you guys. I'm absolutely loving color and I have a few pieces already that I'm excited to wear this summer, but green, orange, pink, and purple are the colors I'm really excited to rock and incorporate regularly. You guys have already seen the green that I do own. This knit top is one. Love, love, love this top. This twist halter top is another piece. I actually also have a pair of sunglasses that I got from Verge Girl that are so fun and bold and they actually look so good on. I love rocking those. Another color I do have, but I'm excited to maybe buy a couple more pieces. Well, I did buy a piece. I bought this really beautiful racer tank style bodycon dress, but it's lavender. So I'm really excited about that. This is another 
lavender purple color that I have. It's a wrap top. Definitely very much more of a statement to rock. It's sexy, it's bold. So be sure to check out my tutorial on different ways to rock this top, but definitely a bodycon dress could be a great alternative or a tee or a cute little polo. This dress is another one that I absolutely love. It is terry cloth, but I love, love, love this color. So purple, lilac, lavender, love, love, love. And then pink, you guys, I surprisingly don't have a lot of pink. The pink that I do have is my uh, favorite Prada bag. I absolutely love this bag, the second hand. So I love incorporating that into my wardrobe. Um, but I'm definitely excited to buy another bag, something a little bit more bright in my opinion, something crossbody. I think a colorful bag is great. And I'm also maybe even thinking like an orange purse. Orange is my favorite color. And I'm surprised that I don't have an orange bag. You guys, I am surprised I don't have one, but definitely wanna buy an orange bag. I did buy another bodycon dress, an orange one. I think that is just such an easy way to incorporate the color. But there's so many race of back tanks, there's blazers. I've even seen like a really cool green blazer that I saw Haley Baldwin wore. So really fun, bold colors and kind of classic silhouettes I think will be so fun. So dresses, tops, blazers, bags. And I'll be sure to link some options for you babes below if you want to try colors. And uh, another piece that I love that's actually pink and definitely aligns with the color trend is my dress shirt. So I love dress shirts to rock over bikinis, great cover-up option, just a classic piece. So I've had this one, but you can definitely rock it over dresses. And I've shared a look, which I will insert here for you guys to see, a dress, and then you throw on a collared or a dress shirt. But there's so many different ways to rock dress shirts. So I love, love, love this one. And there's also another purchase I made, a dress shirt with matching shorts made out of like dress shirt material. That leads me to my next trend, matching sets, which you guys already saw the Paloma wool knit set. But matching sets, as I said, knits are such a great option for summer. A great alternative to sweats I've been living in, but I just think they're so fun and great and matching sets. So you guys, so easy, very versatile. So you can rock this shirt with some jeans, you can rock with some shorts, a skirt, or you can rock these with tees, you can rock it with a cute little crop top, but love, love, love these, so freaking cute. So matching sets, not only do you get one cute outfit, super easy outfit, you also can rock it in multiple ways. So I'm definitely excited for my shirt and short situation, so be sure to follow to peep that. But another great option is something like this, that's terry cloth. Absolutely love this set, which leads me to the next trend, terry cloth. I bought this set last summer, it's from Frankie's Bikinis. It is a bit expensive, super comfortable, a great alternative to sweats, but yeah, a bit pricey, but the quality is so, so, so nice. I did get one gifted to me from Miss Lola and the quality isn't the best. So if it's something that you are gonna wear often, that is a classic. I definitely recommend the Frankie's one. It fits so nice. I also picked up a triangle bikini that I absolutely love. It's this white color, so it matches perfectly with this. Again, you could wear this with shorts and a cute crop top. You can wear these alone with a cute little vintage tee or your bikini. Also, since they're right here, if you are into terry cloth, I love, love, love this dress, but you can also rock it with a bucket hat. If you've been following me, you've seen these bucket hats. I love a bucket hat for the summer, for the pool. So easy. This one's actually from Cotton On, very affordable. I do have the Lack of Colors one. Honestly, it is the same thing, a little bit heavier and a fraction of the price. So definitely something you can go affordable. This one is from Urban Outfitters and it is so freaking cute. I kind of like the shorter one, but the Cotton On one is similar to the Lack of Colors where it is a little bit longer. So there are a couple different ways you guys can incorporate terry cloth and it's just so comfortable, so fun. Such a great cover up for the beach since it is, you know, this towel material. So definitely get some terry cloth in your life. Next trend that I'm loving are sheer transparent pieces. I've talked about mesh pieces since last fall. I love those really bright colored groovy print mesh tops, 
but something in like a solid color. So I am obsessed with this Acne Studios look. I found a secondhand Christian Dior skirt to recreate this look. And I finally found the perfect top from Zara, which I'm so excited. I just ordered it. So it is coming in. Be sure to follow for that to see how I style it. If you want to see a little haul, let me know. Also, let me know other brands you love and I could do a haul with them. Um, but I'm absolutely into sheer tops. I was on the hunt for that sheer top that I ended up purchasing. And um, before I found that top, I found this one, which I do love, but it is a bit more mesh versus sheer. Uh, and I really think these are so cute. Obviously you can rock it with a tank underneath a little tube top, but I love mesh, it's just fresh and easy and really excited to incorporate that into my summer outfits. And then the next trend I want to talk about are cutouts. So bringing back this Paloma wool top, see that little cutout? I love that little keyhole. There are so many different ways to rock that kind of cutout. The bodysuit I'm rocking is the perfect example. There are dresses which are super cute, little kind of peephole, also super sexy going out dresses that you can rock. Even rocking a cardigan, and I read this online, it's kind of like it's barely holding on by a thread kind of cardigan vibe. And I think it's really cute and a fun kind of sexy statement piece to experiment with. But cutouts are definitely gonna be something I'm excited to experiment with. You can definitely achieve this look with a tank. This one is from Miss Lola and came this way and I really, really love it. So there are tons of pieces you can rock and get that keyhole vibe, but I'm very excited for that. Um, this is actually another knit top that I'm just seeing here from House of Sunny that I absolutely love, but this also has kind of like the cutout in it as well. So super fun, great pieces, knit, super soft and colorful. So again, you can buy one piece, you guys, that achieves the trend. Here's another example of it. So love a little keyhole, love a little peekaboo, love a little cutout very excited i'll link some of my favorites below for you babes to see now let's talk about accessories so purses i've already talked about bright colored bags I definitely want to find an orange one i saw by far has a really cute orange one and i also have my little prada one balenciaga has a really cute one the Net neo mini which i've tried on it's great size but a little bit pricey so i love that but bright colored accessories bags and maybe brights aren't your thing you don't want to invest in that much I've seen canvas bags and maybe you're already rocking a canvas bag, but we have tons of canvas bags lying around. I have some great ones that I've been gifted and easy peasy, works with everything. Great for the beach, just super casual and jewelry. So I have been rocking these for a minute, but chunky beaded jewelry. This one is from Depop. I love it. It had a little butterfly on it, but that fell off and I love the pearls. I just ordered a new one from Ian Charms and she is customizing it. I had her put a little Corvette on there, which I'm so excited about. If you guys are new here, I'm a Chevy lover and she is customizing a cute little charm necklace for me with the Corvette. I've been rocking these chunky rings as well, which are a great item to style. Super easy, as you can see, I'm rocking with my gold jewelry already, but chunky jewelries, pearls. I have some great beaded pieces that were gifted to me. Well, here's a pearl one that I absolutely love with this floral closure. I love it, love this little toggle. Also, this one is a half pearl, half puka. So freaking cute. And I got this last summer from Math. It's from Greece. So beautiful. Just love the pearls. And then this one was gifted to me by a follower. It has I'm LVH on it. It has my initials and I love it. And it's so freaking cute. You guys can totally make these yourself as well. But I do love supporting small brands and businesses. And they're just so cool. This one I love. I'll link the Depop store below. So chunky jewelry. So fun, such a fun statement. I think we all should bring a little bit more play into our lives and have fun with fashion. I love experimenting and trying new things. And now let's talk about some shoes, which I already own that I do rock. And my Nike Dunks and Jordans, I think you're gonna be seeing them more and more. They're definitely a bold street style edgy statement, but I love them. And in bright colors, I have the low rise Dunks. I have the West Coast color, which is shocking because it is the UCLA color combo and I went to USC, but uh, they're so cute, so I had to get them. And then I also have my New Balances. I'm seeing a lot more sneakers, which I'm sure we all have, and I've had these, so if you've been eyeing them, I would definitely recommend investing in them because they're just cool. I don't think they're gonna go out of style, and they're very comfortable, so I love that. And then another trend that I'm excited to try that I've been seeing are platforms. 
yes platforms i have these white sandals that i wear often from Ducey london i love them i wish i got black but the white's fun i just noticed a little bit more wear on the white just because it's more obvious but i also invested in these babies from tilly's they haven't arrived yet but i really wanted to try kind of that 90s 2000 lizzie mcguire mule platform mule and they're very affordable and i definitely recommend going more of the affordable route when you want to try a new trend because you'll see if you like it or not i'm definitely excited to try out those platforms rock them with dresses rock them with jeans and i think there's gonna be like a really fun bold statement especially also something that's gonna elevate me a bit. I am 5'1", so I am petite, and I think there's gonna be like a fun way to like walk around and do things, you know? So those are all of the trends I'm really excited to embrace, to rock, to wear, to bring out again. So I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. If you wanna see more videos from me, be sure to subscribe to my channel. And if you have any other video requests, styling requests, whatever fashion related or brands to review and share, then be sure to comment them below and I'll be sure to link very similar things. I'll link whatever is available that is exactly the same as what I have. And yeah, I will let you go and I'll catch my next video. Bye.